This tutorial will walk you through an example of simulating loaded shell or plate structures in Abacus. We will load a flat plate in a direction perpendicular to its planar surface so that it undergoes bending. One edge of the plate is fixed so that it cannot translate or rotate about any axis. Two concentrated forces of 7000 newtons each are applied at two points on the opposite edge. The plate will be partitioned twice and the two points where the partition lines meet the edge can then be used to apply the concentrated forces. The dimensions of the plate are displayed in the schematic. The units are in SI with length in meters. The plate is 0.1 meters or 10 centimeters thick. It is made of steel with a density of 7.8 grams per centimeter cubed, a Young's modulus of 200 gigapascals, and a Poisson's ratio of 0.3. We will talk about some aspects of shell simulations that you need to understand, such as section integration and whether it needs to be performed before or during the analysis. We will see how to apply shell thickness as a section property and briefly talk about the Simpson and Gauss thickness integration rules. We will also talk about shell offsets. We will assume this problem is mildly nonlinear. Initially, when the plate is flat and just beginning to bend, it will have bending stiffness. However, after it has bent a little bit, some of the bending will also be resisted by in-plane membrane effects. Hence, Abacus needs to update the stiffness matrix to include the added membrane stiffness. This makes our problem a geometrically nonlinear one, and we'll use the nonlinear geometry or NLGEOM option. So open up a new model in Abacus, and let's do this.